I chose Edgewood College because it was close to home. Um, also, the coach at the time, Bubba Schultz, really made um, an impact on me and I was excited to come and play for him. Of all the opportunities that I was promised being a student athlete here and all of them came true. Every year for tennis, I was promised a spring break trip and we've gone to Myrtle Beach, Orlando, which has been super fun. And then we had beautiful courts available to us just off campus, which most schools didn't. Um, and they showed me a bunch of gear that we'd be getting for the next year and every year they've loaded us up with gear. So I really came here to play sports and then of course you're in intertwined with one of the best campuses in UW-Madison. So couldn't be a better place than Edgewood College. It's in the heart of Madison. However, it is a small school, which seemed more perfect for me because I need that small community. Transfer from UW-Madison, and I came here for the nursing program. Um, I wanted to get a more like personal, smaller class sizes um, and get a really good clinical experience. Actually, toured Edgewood College in high school, um, and at first, I didn't think I'd like it because of how small it is, but I'm really like grateful for the small community it has here, and I got to meet a lot of close friends that way. One of the things that makes the Edgewood College tennis team so special is that it's more than just a men's team. We practice every day with the women's team, and we really have a close bond. We go to each other's matches, which is just super fun to have that whole team camaraderie. And then specifically on the guy side, um, we're super tight-knit, we hang out with each other, and everybody just wants to win and, and have fun. We've had a lot of the girls on the team for quite some time, and actually this year and last year we've had the same girls on the team, the same eight girls, which is pretty cool, so we got to grow together. Um, we've all like playing with different partners and gotten to try like a bunch of different lineups, which has been interesting but fun along the way. We are always there for each other. Um, throughout our matches we always cheer each other on, yell each other's name and I feel like that is a really positive impact on all of us. I've made connections with friends that I never thought I would make before like ever in my life and uh, something about them I know that they will always have my back and they will always be there for me even after college and when we're all moving on with our future. I can always look back and know that these people were special to me. I have a couple moments that stand out for me from playing tennis here. Um, the late night when I first transferred and started practicing in the spring, um, we would go out to hitters like nine o'clock at night and hit and that was always, everyone was like so tired and crazy and then we complete 180 and then started doing morning practices the next year. So just like seeing everyone at the weirdest hours, like we all, I'd say we all got closer from that. On memories that stand out, definitely like the two spring break trips I was able to go on. We went to Hilton Head and then this past year we went to Disney. So like spending a lot of time together, waiting in lines and just getting to know each other better. It's a lot of fun. I think my favorite moment relating to tennis has been winning conference freshman and sophomore year. Um, beating CU Dub both of those times really felt good because those are our biggest rivals and hopefully we can do it again in a couple of days, yeah. Two memories pop to mind. Um, one being our trip to Orlando this year. We just had a ton of fun, went to Universal, went to Cocoa Beach, swam in the ocean, and we played a ton of fun matches, so that was an unreal experience. And then second one was clinching a berth in the conference tournament this year. We had a match against CU CUC, and they had a big home crowd there that was talking to us the whole match, so winning that match was, was cool. Going all the way back to freshman year, um, my doubles partner at the time was injured, and I had to play with somebody completely new who wasn't in the doubles lineup at the number one spot. And we ended up pulling off that win and I feel like that was a huge confidence booster for like myself and the team. Although we didn't win, it was still like a fun battle. I would like to thank so many people. I wouldn't have started tennis without my parents pushing me to start it 
freshman year of high school. And then I would love to thank all my coaches throughout high school, Glenn Slonak, Jim Slonak, Keith, and then Mark Picard for letting me know about Edgewood. Um, without him and his lessons, I would have never known this school would have existed and I never would have been able to continue on with my career in tennis. Definitely want to thank my parents for just pushing me to be here and giving me all the opportunities they have my whole life, um, along with my sisters, my cousins that I've played sports with my whole life and, and they've really taught me the love for the game and then of course just all my coaches here that have uh, push me to be the best version of myself on the court as well as off the court. Yeah, I definitely want to thank uh, my parents for supporting me through tennis. Um, and my brothers are good role models for tennis. I did, once I started college, I did not think I was going to ever pick up a racket again. I took a two year break until I transferred. And then Cecile, who's on the team, I actually grew up playing tennis with her and she convinced me to join when I transferred because I was really hesitant about it. Um, but I'm really glad I joined and then I just want to thank my teammates for being there for me through college because I really needed them to get through all the hard times and yeah, just thank you to my family and friends for giving me a great um, college career and a good experience playing tennis in college. I would like to thank my family, my mom and my dad for always supporting me and my sister. We grew up playing tennis together and she's made me the player who I am today. Um, I'd also like to thank uh, Bubba, Sh Bubba Schultz, my the old tennis coach, for always being there and supporting me. And I'd also like to thank Kevin, the new tennis coach, um, for allowing me to grad assist next year, which I'm very excited about. I think what I'll miss most about Edgewood College is just going to every practice and competing with people. I, I love to compete in any sport, so every day practicing with people that feel the same way has been the best part. The, the team dinners, team breakfast, just hanging out with the teams and, and has been really fun. I think I'm going to miss the freedom of knowing that college, yes, school is not the most fun, but the freedom of being able to go out with friends, being able to do several different things during free time, and when you go off to work, you got to worry about being busy all the time, and so I think I'll definitely miss that freedom and knowing that I have friends surrounding me at any point in time. Just being with my friends every day and getting to see them. Um, just like I live downtown, so carpooling and like driving around and just spending time and getting to see my friends every day. I'm really gonna miss. I will miss playing tennis the most, competing and spending time with um, all my teammates, but I am excited to coach and still be a part of Edgewood College.